Ready? Okay. Hey, welcome back to Amateur Hour. <laughs> hey, uh, uh. <laughs> hey, welcome back to Amateur Hour. I'm Jordan. And I'm Bree. And uh, today, Bree is gonna make me a drink. Don't know what it is yet, but I'm about to find out. Yes, I'm making a cranberry crush. I don't know where the name really comes from in the drink, but mm. I found it online and I had all the ingredients laying around my house. Perfect. Just three ingredients, so super simple. Mm. It's spice rum, cranberry juice, and ginger beer. So, okay, easy. sounds like it has potential. It does have potential. I'm very interested to see what it's gonna taste like because I haven't tried it. <laughs> so, we're gonna find out. Hey, you're getting honest reactions here on <laughs> yeah. Amateur Hour. So, you're gonna do two ounces of spice rum per okay. drink. So, we're gonna do four ounces. Nice. Love the spiced. Me too. No spills. No, I'm getting Look better. Look at this progress. I'm getting better. Attention. <laughs> Alrighty, and then. <laughs> Need help? You got it? I got it. It's really cold. I'm usually not cold, but it's pretty cold. Yeah. Then you're gonna do two ounces per drink of the cranberry juice. So again, four ounces. So simple measurements, equal parts. You so... just did that like you weren't even thinking about it. You're so good at this now. I know. Oh my gosh. And then <laughs> you're going to combine it with your ice. Okay. As we see here, I do have Lee's fancy shaker, so yep. we're gonna, wait, how do you do it? Oh yeah, like a pro, like a pro. <laughs> Let's see if I can I open it. Just whistling Dixie. <laughs> okay. Is it better if I hit it up top or down below? I think if you hit where they're connected, right? Yeah. So it's like down like there. <gasps> My hands. Oh! Look at that. Round of applause. <laughs> All right, and then you're just gonna strain it into your oh, glass. Oh, it's pretty. I think I made a little bit more than I needed to. Well, there's still some in here. We'll make an extra drink. It's okay. And then, all I had a little at home was diet ginger beer. Okay. It's okay. So you just top it, give it a little fizz. I'm gonna get in here and give you some. And then that's it. Looks pretty. I know, I like the color. Cranberry yeah. juice in the winter, I feel like, you know, cranberries, winter. I feel like it's gonna be a good summer drink, too. Yeah, you real. Should I stir it a little? Uh, sure. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I've got my spoon. Let me try not to spill it. I'm spilling it everywhere. Just do like the, the twist. The ice isn't moving in this glass. <laughs> <laughs> a, little, a little overcrowded here. All right, All right let's try this thing. Sippy sip. Cheers. Cheers. It's not bad. It's a little sweet, but pretty good. I like I it mean, a lot. Cranberry stands out. Mm -hmm. I taste the spice rum, though. Yeah? I taste the vanilla. Okay, I should go back for another. <laughs> <laughs> I taste vanilla. Mm. Mm hmm. Yeah, I got the vanilla. Don't get much of the other spices in the spice rum. Mm -mm. Don't want to reveal what they all are. Well, cinnamon and the, the magic third. Mm -hmm. I like the fizz, so I like the ginger beer in it, but I like ginger beer. But you could top it with like soda water, tonic water. No, I think the ginger's the right way to go. I know, I'm just giving people options. Mm. Options. Options. Oh, yeah, it's an amateur hour, you know. You gotta customize You don't have it. ginger beer at home, you just have some sparkling water. So, what do you think Prosecco would work in it? <gasps> yeah, Prosecco. Prosecco, Prosecco would, in it. would work. It's a, it's a, a hang on, it's a, yeah, it's a, uh, it's a cranberry crush. Uh, Spice rum. <laughs> and ginger, and ginger beer. beer in it. <laughs> if you know the reference, comment below if you know We're the reference. We're only like two months late for that. Yeah, so. yeah. All right, well, the recipe's gonna be in the description below and on our website. Definitely try it out. These are really simple ingredients you probably have lying around your house. So give it a try. Yeah, thanks for joining us for Amateur Hour. And uh, hey, stop in the distillery. We have our new Queen Charlotte Reserve Navy Strength out. 55% alcohol has 110 proof. Mm -hmm. uh, sounds really strong, but does not taste as hot as you think smooth. it's going to. Real sweet, smooth, great flavor balance. Awesome smell. So come in and pick that up. We'll see you next time. All right, bye. Don't start yet. How do I, I look? I look decent? Sexiest. <laughs> Maybe I should do a quick shot.